And Governor Steve Bullock delivers his final State of the State address on Thursday night at the Capitol. MTN's chief political reporter Mike Dennison will be there and he gives us a preview of what we can expect. Governor Bullock's final term in office ends next year, so 2019 is his final regular legislative session as governor, and thus his last opportunity to deliver a State of the State address to a joint session of the House and Senate. The speech gets underway at 7 p.m. in the House chamber. The Democratic governor writes some of the speech himself, but also relies on the help of and editing suggestions from his communications staff. Thursday's speech likely will catalog the highlights of Bullock's record, in his view, and make a pitch for key parts of his proposed state budget, such as continuing Medicaid expansion, creating a state-funded preschool program, freezing college tuition, and his ambitious plan for $290 million in state-funded infrastructure all across Montana. Bullock also may unveil a new proposal or two, but those details remain under wraps. House Democratic leader Casey Schreiner of Great Falls says it's a chance for the governor to speak directly to the people about his take on the progress of Montana. It's good to every couple of years have a conversation with your governor to, to see how things are going and get a perspective on why things are the way they are and maybe some changes that need to come. The governor's speech will be streamed live on MTN stations across the state. But Bullock isn't playing to a totally receptive audience in the building. Republicans control majorities in both houses of the legislature. And already, GOP lawmakers have been busy working up counterproposals to the governor's big plans. Republican Senate President Scott Sales of Bozeman will be delivering the GOP's response to the governor's speech shortly after it's finished. I think we can count on hearing a somewhat different vision for Montana from leaders of the Republican majority. But first, we'll be here on the House floor hearing the vision of our Democratic governor one last time. At the Capitol, Mike Dennison, MTN News. And like Mike mentioned, you can watch the governor's State of the State address streaming live on our website, ktvh.com. Again, that speech is scheduled to begin at 7 o'clock tomorrow night.